This video was made possible by EA Game Changers. Thank you EA for giving me this opportunity and I hope you will enjoy the video. Welcome back to my channel, my name is Tam and if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to take a look at The Sims 4 Realm of Magic. Thank you EA for providing me with a copy of the game for reviewing purposes. Uh, this video has been um, made possible by a program called EA Game Changers and I received a copy of the game for um, reviewing purposes, like I said. Uh, I am not being compensated in any way, shape or form for making this video and all of the op opinions are going to be my uh, own. So you guys. Uh, uh, today, like I said, we're going to take a look at the build and buy section of The Sims 4 Realm of Magic uh, game pack and uh, yeah, let's get started you guys. So, uh, as with every single review that I do, overview, first of all I'm going to showcase the pre-made rooms that we got. The first one is uh, Alchemist Skulkery, uh, let's buy this one. I think it looks really 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 nice we have a cauldron in the middle this is like a kitchen type of thing and I really really like it I like the herbs on the walls and I definitely uh, would like to have this in my own home you can raise uh, the room like uh, that and you can make it maybe yay you can you can uh, uh, borrow it down and it looks really really nice. The second one is Arcanist's Retreat. It's like a bedroom type of thing and also we got a cot for your um, toddler, not toddlers, for your babies and this is so adorable. I definitely see myself using this one a lot. The bedroom in general is adorable and I love it. I don't know if this is actually functional. I think it's not but oh my god it's it, it looks really 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 nice really impressed with everything that we got here then we have which is layer uh wizard's layer sorry wizard's layer and it's literally a wizarding room it looks super adorable i love the flooring i love the wallpapers i love everything that we got here the windows are adorable i love the gothic type of vibe for this pack it looks really 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 nice and then the last one is like a backyard type of thing with a cauldron um you can place this uh alongside of your house we have herbs we have planter pots we have a cauldron in the middle super adorable and super nice i don't know how can you bear yeah we, you cannot um have uh the gate when you bury this down but yeah it's it's really 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 nice and um I think it's the pre-made rooms are really adorable. I definitely would like to use uh, all four of them. So uh, that's everything for the pre-made uh, rooms. Now I am going to showcase the build section first and then we're going to hop on to buy. I am going to make a wall so I can showcase. Um, let's start with the wallpapers first. Uh, all we got four different types of wallpapers in Realm of Magic. This is the first one. This is the second one. Let me just switch to the afternoon. This is the third one. The brick one is adorable. And this is the fourth one. They all look adorable and there is a bunch of uh, different swatches. I am, I'm not going to swatch every single one, but they are beautiful. And these are the tiles for the bathroom. Finally, we have something new. As for the flooring, we only have, oopsie not, uh, we have two types of floors. This first one is like a brick type of floor and the second one is the, um, the decal one, which I personally really love. Then, uh, as for the doors, we got, uh, four types of doors, yeah. Not four, sorry. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, six types of doors. These are for the, uh, smaller, um smaller walls and let me try to address the height of the wall so i can show everything okay and then we got these ones we got these ones uh these ones and the arch everything is adorable i definitely see myself using these ones a lot especially the uh these ones and these ones and this is actually adorable because i love the entryway around it it's super 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 cute uh, as for the windows uh, we got uh, this like side type of window. I don't, I don't know how can you use this, but builders probably already know that. 
Uh, I'm not a builder, so I cannot exactly tell you how do you how can you use this. And then we got how can I showcase? Okay, uh, this one. Okay, this is really 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 nice, really nice. And then the last one that I cannot show because uh, my wall is way too small is this window. And uh, I think you can yeah you can move it uh, wherever you want on the wall, so you can maybe lift this, not this. So, oopsie, this one you can lift up a little bit. Uh, so, this looks really, really nice and, yeah, definitely usable. Then, also, we got this uh, that can go um, on top of your windows like that. No, obviously, not on top of that one, but uh, you have that. And you have a little type of balcony that is not usable in The Sims, but you can place it if you want. As for the fencing, uh, we got two types of fences. Uh, let me try to showcase this. Uh, this is the first fence that we got. And this is the second fence that we got. Um, you obviously have a lot of swatches for the fences. You have this green one. And on this side, let's go with the pink one. I don't know. Uh, they're very nice. Very interesting. And um, this fence can go with both types of actually it goes a little bit better with this one but also you can match it with this one if you would like that uh, and also you got the banister for uh, the stairs uh, which i do not have right here i don't know with which stairs you are able to use this banister but i am going to showcase it on these ones uh, like I said, I'm not a builder, so I'm not really good with building, but these are, uh, this is the banister that you can use. It's really nice and actually looks really cool with these stairs. <laughs> I did a good job. So, uh, that is everything that we got in Realm of Magic, Magic, if I'm not mistaken. And also we got a fountain that goes with Realm of Magic. Really nice and really cool. As for the plants, we didn't got anything new, which is kind of weird, but okay. I respect that. Now I'm going to bulldoze the terrain and bulldoze the entire lot so I can showcase the um, buy section uh, for Realm of Magic. So let's start. Uh, I'm just going to place one of each. I'm not going to do the entire swatch type of thing. So we got the single bed. We got this double bed. I love this bed. This bed is dream, you guys. Then we got uh, a lot of different type of types of chairs that I definitely see myself using these ones they are adorable uh, they are my cup of tea I uh, personally like this style and uh, I think that this is going to be an adorable um, buy section so definitely see myself using this one <coughs> and also we have a counters but we do not have the cabinets for the kitchen kind of strange maybe they forgot this time as well we don't know uh, this table is adorable then we got this little smaller table. Uh, I We have this table with a glowing type of thing over here. Uh, super adorable. I don't know what's a uh, will-o'-wisp desk. Perfect for creatives who are looking for a little spark of inspiration. It's really interesting desk and I personally really like it. Then we got the wand display type of thing. You can display your, um, your magical wand. We have this cabinet. I personally think it's beautiful then we got this sink this toilet and this shower um, um like what's what's the name of this um what lodini's chamber of sprinkles wow that that sounds interesting like chamber of secrets but it's chamber of sprinkles super cute then we got two different cauldrons if i'm not mistaken this is the first one and this is the second one i love both of them they are really really nice then we got a bar and i do need a, a cup a wall in order to showcase a couple of things so i'm going to place the wall right here so i can um showcase what i would like so we're going to turn like this we got this decal this decal then we got a mirror adorable mirror this is the second one i personally love this one look at that you guys it's super adorable is it a snake no i thought it was a snake uh but it's like um, a flowery wine that goes uh, around it it's super beautiful we got these curtains these curtains and these curtains I adore all of these beautiful then we got a um, rug that you can um, use to sorry you can use use two pieces to co to connect it interesting uh, 
Uh, then we got this huge rug and we got these, this huge rug that you cannot properly see, but it's like a triangle in the middle. It looks like something from the uh, TV show Charmed. Then we got the fireplace with the crystals inside it. We got the herbs. Uh, I don't know what this is. Working scale. Oh, it's a scale for your kitchen. Nice. Then we got this cabinet and this cabinet. Super adorable for a witchy room. I really, really, really think it's great. Then we got the bassinet for a baby. Uh, this is uh, like a crystal uh, on the display. We got um, these little um, antique um, light type of things. Um, this is a chandelier that I cannot showcase to you guys because uh, I do not have a ceiling here. Then we have this little light that looks like a bug. This light. Uh, also, we got this cabinet type of thing. Wow, what is that? Is that a fridge? Is this a fridge? Yes, it is! Adorable! I love it. And the stove. Okay, I, I'm personally in love with this. I definitely see myself using this one. Then we got a bookcase that is full of books. It's not just a half a bookcase that is full of books and the empty spaces. I adore these. Then we got a chest of drawers for the bedroom and a little smaller chest of drawers for the bedroom. And I cannot believe that that's everything. Okay! So I managed to showcase everything that we got. Um, let me say, um, the items are pretty impressive. Uh, there are a couple of things that I'm not a bit huge fan of. For example, this carpet is a little bit funny. Uh, but everything else is adorable, you guys. And one of the complaints that I have is that we do not have a top portion for the kitchens. But also, let me just um, say this. I think it's going to be kind of logical from my perspective is logical at least um everything is a kind of wooden type old style from like the old age where witches existed and um where um like i i'm talking about the mythology i'm not talking about real uh, real life so it everything looks like an from the old age and i don't think that they had cabinets at that, that point so maybe that's the reasoning behind that but the kitchen and the stove are adorable and the little cot for the baby super 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 duper adorable i love it and i definitely see myself using a lot of these things in my games the bedroom especially the kitchen type the bassinet the cabinet sorry the cabinets the bassinet for example the tables everything looks pretty nice and yeah that is everything that i have to showcase for the build and buy section for realm of magic um in my personal opinion, uh, I am going to talk about, I talked uh, about that at the end of Create a Sim video and I am going to talk about it right now. I personally think that if you are buying this game for Create a Sim portion or for Build and Buy portion, maybe it's not going to be worth $19.99, if, I think it's $19.99 yeah, $19 in your currency. But if you're buying this pack for the entire Witch uh, experience and uh, if you want to play with witches, this is going to be worth your money, in my personal opinion. <coughs> Sorry. I still have... I had a nasty cold and I still have cough residue uh, from it, so... Uh, I personally think that the build and buy section is worth the money that you would um, spend to buy this pack. Um, and I definitely see myself using a lot of these things in uh, that I just showcased to you guys. So, that is going to be everything for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of my videos. And I'm going to talk to you guys in my next one. Bye!